Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make oatmeal that tastes like dessert. It's got protein, oatmeal, and fruit, and it is amazing. Let's check it out. So this is everything you're gonna need. You need frozen fruit, quick oats, almond milk, and you can have unflavored almond milk, you could have just regular water, you can use milk, any kind of liquid you want to use, any kind of protein powder you want to use. I recommend the Spartan Whey, tastes like vanilla ice cream, it's so good. And then you have some ground flaxseed, and you want to make sure it's ground up because that's how you absorb all the nutrients in it because you have to break that outer shell and it's a great source of omegas. All right, so first we want to measure out the oatmeal. You want about a half a cup of oatmeal, of dry oats, and about one cup of water. All right, next you're gonna throw it in the microwave for about a minute and a half. All right, our oatmeal's done. And you want it to have like a runny consistency because we're gonna be adding a lot of powders and the flaxseed and it's gonna soak up that water. So next you wanna have a scoop of protein. Then we're gonna add about two tablespoons of ground flaxseed. want to try to even it out so that when you mix it, it all goes in the oatmeal and you don't have little clumps of flax or protein or anything like that. And the last thing you want to do is add your frozen fruit. I like peaches. It tastes like peach cobbler when it comes out and mango makes it very sweet. So we're going to add some peaches. Now I usually pack this in my lunch bag, take it to work, throw it in the microwave when I get there because it's already cold. So after I put it in the microwave at my office, it melts these frozen fruit pieces and legit makes it taste like peach cobbler. So we put maybe about a half a cup of these peaches. And then we're gonna add about a quarter of these mango. There you go. Doesn't look the best, but it tastes amazing. 